What's up, everybody? Stefan here from Mod the Frame. As you see, I'm standing here with Mike's Corvette, and that's because we're about to shoot this thing. But a little bit of uh, history behind the car. The car has been in the family for probably about seven to eight years now, the car has been in the family. So over that time, what has been done? Um, this car is lowered. It's lowered uh, on factory bolts, lowered all the way. Uh, front bolts removed, replaced with uh, um, pads so that it doesn't make noise, as well as extended rear bolts to make it go as low as it is right now. Uh, the suspension upgrade so far has consisted of C6 Z06 shocks as well as uh, C6 Z51 sway bars as well as uh, Moo sway bar end links. Also, what's done to the car is, as you can see, three-piece 20-inch wheels. Uh, company that made them was D2 Forged. Uh, matte black center, gloss black lip, red inner barrel. As you can see, these big things right here C6 Z06 brakes on this car. C6 Z06 brakes on the front and on the rear, uh, it has the front brakes from this car. We move them to the rear so that it has the bigger rotor, um, as well as some cross drilled rotors in the back, I believe. Yep, cross drills in the back with the factory fronts moved to the back. Uh, there's a couple of how to do these on uh, Corvette Forum if you're looking at how to make your rear brakes bigger. Um, the car also has uh, the Depot style headlights. Um, we did these many, many moons ago. Um, what we did to make them look better though, these are the ones with the black inner housings. What we did to make them better is mask off just the light output where the light will come out and then paint the rest of the headlight and then clear over it. The reason why I keep saying we did it a long time ago is because as you can see now, there's some peeling of the clear coat around the edges and on the other headlight, clear coat as well as uh, some of the paint came up. So these definitely have to be redone. The front lip is a ZR1, C6 ZR1 style front lip on this car. Um, looks really, really good. But as you can see from driving around New York City, it's a little cracked up. Um, but that's probably going to be replaced as well. Um, the thing is, the reason why I'm spending so much time with this car is because it's going to leave soon. It's going to go up on eBay. <laughs> so he's selling this car and he's selling it the way it is, all modified, all hooked up. He wants to clean up a couple little things like what we talked about. Um, the car also has a boiler exhaust. say it um it has boiler stinger i believe is what it is and uh the covers on the seats uh it's a reupholstery of the seat so the old leather came off and this two-tone red and black interior leather is on uh the roof before was red it was painted black so it gives it a more aggressive look um also little things like tinted lights front rear tail lights as well and there's a couple more things done to the car, but nothing performance related. The car is completely stock. It is an automatic car and it does have 243 gears. So you saw in the video though, when it was racing the Maserati, it did really, really, really well 
for how quick it is. Oh, by the way, if you didn't see that video, go back to the video that says Street Speed 717 stole my 15 seconds of fame, and you will see this car running against the 2017 Maserati Ghibli. But anyway, on a more important things, I don't want to talk your head off on this one. Um, I want us to go drive the car. You see what it looks like. You see how pretty it is. Um, there are some like small, small minor things like uh, fiberglass buckling a little bit. Uh, in the rear on the rear hatch i'll show it to you as well as on the door seams uh you'll see it as well i'll drop some pictures in there so that you could see it otherwise besides that the car is super clean super nice i think it has like 68,000 miles on it and i think he's letting the car go for like 17 so you can't beat that but uh let's wrap it up let's go for a drive and let's see how it is guys that pretty much brings this video to a close i hope you guys enjoyed it if you like the video please let us know in the comments like and subscribe also tell a friend we're trying to get mod to fame to a thousand subscribers by the end of the month until our next video bye.